got a very, very exciting afternoon this afternoon. Uh, we will be witnessing the first flight of White Knight 2 in public at a, a demonstration event such as Oshkosh. Pete Siebold is going to be doing some very exciting flying. And Sir Richard Branson is going to be flying in White Knight 2 for the first time. But before that, we've got a very, very exciting announcement and a signing ceremony for a deal which was uh, sealed over the weekend, the terms of which were agreed, which is a, a deal to take Virgin Galactic truly into the second part of the 21st century. We've just signed an agreement with Abar Group of Abu Dhabi, who are making an investment in Virgin Galactic and taking a stake in the company, and have also committed to work with us to develop a satellite launch system for White Knight 2 which is extremely exciting. That would allow us to be able to put satellites into space far more cheaply and environmentally efficiently than has ever been done before and reduce the cost of satellite launches quite dramatically, which would allow satellites to be used for a whole new range because at the moment it is just too expensive for some of the applications which they're capable of doing. And I'd like to call up on stage, first of all, uh, Mohammed El Husseini and Sir Richard Branson. Now, uh, Mohammed and Richard, you're going to be signing the deal live here this morning. Would you, would you like to do that first and then uh, give you both a chance to have a chat and a bit of a Q&A? So we'll just bring the documents up. Thank you very much. This is the real, the real, the real, this is the real thing. <laughs> and the other one. the mics over to Mohammed Al Husseini and Sir Richard Branson. I don't know if you want to say a few words each then we'll do it. Uh, I'd love uh, um, Sheikh Mohammed to speak first. <laughs> uh, uh, we, we are very excited uh, uh, in, in, in Abu Dhabi. Uh, Abad Investments uh, uh, is a company that invests into different sectors uh, including but not limited to uh, the venture that we currently have with Sir Richard uh, Branson. Uh, we, we normally try to invest in sectors that uh, hopefully provide added benefits uh, to Abar within Abu Dhabi. Uh, you may or may not know we are also investors, as an example, in uh, Daimler Mercedes, where today we are uh, the single largest uh, shareholders of, uh, of Mercedes. And we think uh, uh, Virgin Galactic is, uh, to us, is equally a very exciting uh, opportunity and we think it will provide a lot of benefits uh, to us. Well, thank you very much. Um, now, as, as Will said earlier, it's, a, it's an enormously exciting day. I was um, privileged to uh, meet uh, His Royal Highness uh, Sheikh Mansour, who has uh, incredible vision, um, vision, vision to uh, really build uh, Abu Dhabi into uh, the, the country of the future, um, a, a, a country that uh, looks after its people uh, and, um, and invests back in wonderful projects for the country. Um, what, one of the things that, that, that today is going to result in uh, is a spaceport being built in Abu Dhabi in the Middle East um, uh, so that uh, you know, people will be able from the Middle East to be able to go into space. Um, and. Uh, and as Will said, um, the, uh, not only the chance to take people into space, to, but to be able to put satellites into space at a fraction of the, of the price that, um, and cost that they have in the past. Um, somebody earlier on to me said uh, that we've had 
three years of gloomy stories, and um, this is a good news story. So, um, thanks very much for being here to celebrate it with us. Um, I'm looking forward to um, getting into the plane now and, and uh, uh, not going up into space, but get, getting a taste of what it's going to be like. Um, but um, tremendously exciting, and um, hopefully there'll be lots of lots more good news stories. But uh, wonderful to be working with um, uh, uh, with, with Abu Dhabi. Thank you very much.